prophecy of Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, is mentioned in various world religious scriptures, including the Christian scriptures. If you read in the book of Deuteronomy, chapter number 18, verse number 18, it says that, I shall raise thee up a prophet from among thy brethren, like unto thee, and I shall put my words into his mouth, and he shall speak all that I command him. In fact, if you analyze, this prophecy of Deuteronomy, chapter number 18, verse number 18, befits no one but the last and final messenger, Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. Now many people will say that the prophecy in Deuteronomy chapter 18 refers to Muhammad, but this simply is not possible. Let's read the prophecy to see what it says. The Lord your God will raise up for you a prophet like me from among your own brethren. Now, this verse is saying that the Lord God will raise up for you, the Israelites, a prophet like me, Moses, from among your own brethren, the Israelites. It's not possible that this can apply to Muhammad for two reasons. One, the verse says, for you. A verse is being read to Israelites. This prophecy is being made to the Israelites. Therefore, Muhammad can't possibly qualify as a prophet who will come to them. He doesn't. He comes to the Ishmaelites in a land far away, in a place far away, in a language that's entirely different to a people that are entirely different many hundreds of years later. It is not this people. So it can't fit the part that says, for you. And nor does Muhammad fit the part that says, from among your own brethren. You see, the term your own brethren applies to other Israelites. It doesn't apply to Ishmaelites. It doesn't apply to anyone else. That's what the term your brethren meant when speaking to Israelites. And we can know this because a few verses before, the very same word is used and defined as Israelites. It says in verse 15, Be sure to appoint over you the king the Lord your God chooses. He must be from among your own brethren. Do not place a foreigner over you, one who is not a brother Israelite. So very clearly it defines brethren as brother Israelites. And this is how it's always used in the Bible. And so, to say that Muhammad qualifies as the prophet for Deuteronomy 18 clearly contradicts the wording, for you and from among your brethren. Therefore, Muhammad cannot be the man prophesied in Deuteronomy 18.